Every now and again a racehorse comes along that bands the masses together in universal appreciation. For the past two years that horse has been Bayid, a horse who has paid homage to the breeding operation of the late Sheikh Hamdan and who has been a superstar for his connections. He is now taking up stallion duties at Shadwell's Nunnery Stud and Will Wright, who has joined the operation recently himself, tells us more about the brilliance of Bayid. It's a privilege to have a horse like Bayid. Um, he's obviously, he's been a, from a Shadwell perspective, it's been a wonderful journey for it right from, from moment one, um, from his win at Leicester all the way through. It's, he's had some great days that obviously were highlighted with, with the Judmont, but he was, he was an outstanding miler with exceptional speeds. Now all that excitement is transferred to, to, the, to the nunnery now with having and across across to Darren's town it's, it's it's just everyone here has got that buzz that excitement um, to have a horse that was as good as him and with which chases back through but bred in the Shadwell blue it's a credit to Sheikh Hamdan and his family um, for all, all that work he put in and look it was so sad that he couldn't have seen seen Baid in action and he, yeah, he would have been so proud um, but at the same time, it's Sheikh Ahisa and family to, to take it on and to have him as that sort of flagship that start that, that sort of started her uh, journey in, in sort of the, the, the Shadwell colours. It's it's incredibly exciting. He has gone down exceptionally well. The best part, obviously, we did our December during the December breeding stock sales, and we had our parades and all this interest. And we'd been my, my phone did not stop ringing, Stephen Collins' phone did not stop ringing, and from it. Everybody came with that interest, and we had nominations that applied from from yeah from way before he started. We've got an exceptional book of mares, and the breeders that have seen him; they've not been disappointed. His, his physically, his temperament, um, and obviously his, his, his just his talent. Um, it all speaks for itself. And yeah, he's we like to think he's he's the complete stallion prospect, and we can he's going to have every single chance with an incredibly exciting first book of mares, and hopefully that will continue into the into the second, third, fourth, etc. We are privileged at Shadwell that we have three different horses, all with sim similar profiles in various ways. Mm -hmm. Ektadar, for example, um, he, he's obviously sort of a group one winning sprinter by Invincible Spirit. He's got, he's got to have every chance from a, from a very good Shadwell family, which as I say, contains Massap um, and Mujbar, a group three winner by Hor who won the Horace Hill at two um, under the first dam. He's, he's got, he's the sort of horse that, look, he's, I think he's flying under the radar. Um, and look, we could be telling a different story come May, given if he had a few, ni few nice early runners and we've been hearing good things from, from buyers and trainers alike. We could be more pleased with Tasley. He's, he's the sort of horse you have to tell to people that he, given the mares, number of mares he covered in his first year and the quality of those mares, he's, he's upgraded them and he's producing racehorses. And that was recognized last year. Um, he covered uh, his biggest and best book yet. So th this, Following year, you'd be following hot on the heels of of that crop, um, and yeah, look if that, that if if they can replicate anywhere near what his two years have done this year with the quantity that's on going to be on the track, um, he'll be a he'll be a hot, an incredibly hot prospect. With Mahatha, the, the Sussex Stakes was, was his day in the sun. Look, he defeated Circus Maximus, Cameco, and Siskin. Um, and he, look, he, he pulled himself around the whole field and with a devastating burst of speed. And that just was to, just testament to the talent that horse had. Um, he was a, a group winner at two, three, and four. It's the most gorgeous looking horse. I challenge anybody to, to find a better looking stallion. Um, like he, and he's, he's sort of stamping his folds with those exact looks and then his good movement and his athleticism. Um, so yeah, we couldn't be more pleased. Foal prices, at, at, during the sales, they reached 110,000 guineas and we supported him myself. I had to pinch myself joining at this time. It's, um, to, yeah, to have a horse like Bayi land on your doorstep and along with along with an exceptionally exciting roster of stallions. Um, yeah, it's, it's incredibly exciting. Uh, it's, and yeah, it's, um, couldn't really ask much more.